Behind them is Talking the Talk, our dear Aru, and then behind them is De Niro Falso. Down to the final flight, Steak and Onions led over it from Rebel Rose in second. In third is Talking the Talk on the run in over towards the far side. Steak and Onions leads under Gary Noonan with Will the Opener for Owen McCarthy. Rebel Rose in second, Talking the Talk third. Behind them is Talking the Talk, our dear Aru, and then Behind them is De Niro Falso. Down to the final flight, Steak and Onions led over it from Rebel Rose in second. In third is Talking the Talk on the run in over towards the far side. Steak and Onions leads under Gary Noonan with Will the Opener for Owen McCarthy. Rebel Rose in second, Talking the Talk third, followed in by De Niro Falso in fourth and Ardira Roo. Going on from Jake's dream, Alice O'Byrne is staying on back in third and then Keen Kyle. But over the final flight, out in front, Chapel Street, stretching clear, six or seven in front, Jake's dream will be pressed for the second by Alice O'Byrne. But as they run to the line, out in front, the clear leader and winner is Chapel Street under Jody Town and Alice O'Byrne through for second. Going on from Jake's dream, Alice O'Byrne is staying on back in third and then Keen Kyle. But over the final flight, out in front, Chapel Street, stretching clear, six or seven in front, Jake Stream will be pressed for the second by Alice O'Byrne, but as they run to the line, out in front, the clear leader and winner is Chapel Street under Jody Town, and Alice O'Byrne through for second, Jake Stream in third, and Keen Kyle four. Down to the final flight in the Boyle Sports Novice Hurl, Dartington by two lengths to Mind Your Money second, back in third is Dixie Flyer, 100 yards to race and Dartington leads, Mind Your Money staying on well but Dartington has his measure as they go to the line, Dartington wins for Gordon Elliott and Corey McGivern. Down to the final flight in the Boyle Sports Novice Hurl, Dartington by two lengths to Mind Your Money second, back in third is Dixie Flyer. 100 yards to race and Dartington leads. Mind your money, staying on well, but Dartington has his measure as they go to the line. Dartington wins for Gordon Elliott and Corey McGivern. Mind your money, close second, clear of Dixie Flyer, in turn clear of Imperial Ruler, up for fourth, just ahead of Cantini Benny. Nelly's money through on the inside. The outside Eagle Moon and between them she tops the lot. They've gone away from Evernock Fizz. On the run in, Nelly's Money far side with the advantage from Eagle Moon. She tops the lot, is trying to rally, but as they go to the line, Nelly's Money driven out by Ambrose McCartan will win for Robert Tyner, takes the Adair Manor opportunity. Nelly's Money too on the inside. The outside Eagle Moon and between them she tops the lot. They've gone away from Evernock Fizz. On the run in, Nelly's Money far side with the advantage from Eagle Moon. She tops the lot, is trying to rally, but as they go to the line, Nelly's Money driven out by by Ambrose McCartan will win for Robert Tyner, takes the Adair Manor opportunity from Eagle Moon, she tops the lot, Evernock Fizz. Transwood jump it in second, Lock and Elog back in third and then Shal Sang on the run in, Call Me Lyreen stretching on, driven out by Conor McNamara, will land the odds, Call Me Lyreen follows up his winning Kilbeg and beats Transwood, Lock and Elog. Transwood jump it in second, Lock and Elog back in third and then Shal Sang on the run in, Call Me Lyreen stretching on, driven out by Conor McNamara, will land the odds, Call Me Lyreen follows up his winning Kilbeg and beats Transwood, Lock and Elo, Og, Shal Sang and last of the five finishers, My Lady Rose. But down to the final fence, Michael Malpick and Simon Torrens is down. Michael Malpick blundered and seated Simon Torrens, leaving outside the door clear on the run-in. Pushed out by Peter Smithers, outside the door will win by seven or eight lengths to roped in second, walking the walk third. But down to the final fence, Michael Malpick and Simon Torrens is down. Michael Malpick blundered and seated Simon Torrens, leaving outside the door clear on the run-in. Pushed out by Peter Smithers, outside the door will win by seven or eight lengths to roped in second, walking the walk third, and in fourth spot, turn down the volume. Heading to the furlong pole and up the outside, Silver Breeze fights it out with Phil's Choice on the far side. Behind him is second subaltern. Telecon is staying on from the back, but well inside the final furlong. Silver Breeze going on under Harry Swan as they go to the line, coming home well. Second subaltern is going to be tight, very tight. <laughs> no, 
heading to the furlong pole and up the outside Silver Breeze fights it out with Phil's choice on the far side behind him his second subaltern Telecon is staying on from the back but well inside the final furlong Silver Breeze going on under Harry Swan as they go to the line coming home well second subaltern is going to be tight very tight between Silver Breeze second subaltern Phil's choice third Telecon probably fourth ahead of Ferdinand Starr.